so what, I, what I, I'm doing is direct cinema, and there's a lot of words for it. The, some people call it cameraless animation, some people call it absolute cinema. Um, I like the word ex direct cinema uh, because what I'm doing is painting and scratching directly onto the surface on, of 35 millimeter film. And uh, in this case, what I'm using is I'm using a little vial of acrylic black ink and I'm using a mapping nib, which is very, very sharp, but it's a, it's a, it's a nib. So I just, I'm testing a new idea by dipping some ink, dipping my pen in some ink, and I'm just trying to see if I can come up with a new kind of character for a new film that I'm starting. I don't know what it's gonna look like yet, but I'm just doing a little, I'm just doing some little sketches and just see, you know, what looks good to me. And uh, I'm really interested in cinema because, well, I'm interested in direct cinema because it's so small and so delicate. And I really like the idea of just making the little marks and having those marks have maybe grand meaning. So this is me. Is art form that you've been using, that you've been uh, exploring for many years now? Yeah, I think um, since about 35 years, I've been, um, I've been trying to develop uh, a, a personal way to express myself and I found direct cinema is for me the best because it doesn't require a lot of expensive tools and I can pretty much set up anywhere and uh, as you can see all I need is a uh, little flashlight underneath this light box a loop and a little vial of ink and it certainly gives me a, a, an idea oh I'd love to just give you an example there's something something there's something sort of Maya Aztec going on here. Um, it sort of looked like hieroglyphics. <laughs> so I'm just like, but I just like playing around with the idea of um, making small shapes and seeing what they're what will develop. I mean, uh, right now this is really not a film, but it's just ideas for a film. And I know I'm not the inventor of direct cinema, but I, I like to say that, you know, I'm adding my voice. Do you sketch a lot on paper beforehand? Or do you like no. working directly on film? I like working directly on film. I, I could say I never, I never sketch on paper. Um, because if I sketch on paper and then I try to make it work on film, I find it's like two different mediums. But by sketching on film, at least I have a better idea what that film is going to look like. And I find if I'm training my muscles to do a specific, you know, like a specific uh, shape, then it's easy to rem remember, to have that muscle memory to do it again. So start small and end small. I think that's my credo.